Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to play Fatal Frame Maiden of Blackwater. Um, to my knowledge, this is a game that is uh, ported to the PC. So let's take a deep dive and figure out how to play. Lurking in the deep. Spirited away. In the vicinity of Mount Hikami, People have been mysteriously disappearing without a trace. One such girl is a Japanese name I cannot pronounce. She awakens to find herself in an old, half-flooded building. Ooh, so do we get to play as her? Mm, is that rippling water or is that hair in water? Looks like hair. Yep, that's hair. That's a body. Is that our... is that our girl? I believe it's our girl. It's brushed and drowned with that much water, jeez. Now she's all wet. And cold. We should find a fire and warm up her body. Surrounded by dead people. That's a great start. What is that metal clanking? Oh, they're not dead. No, they're dead. They're the ghosts. That's not creepy at all. <clears throat> Alright, what do we gotta do? I have to get out of here. Yes, you do. Okay, look around. There we go, there's the door. Oh, gosh. These ghosts are really grabby. Why would I want to walk? Run. Okay, so let's avoid the floating ghosts. That all look the same. There we go. I have to find a way out of here. Yes, I do. Ooh, what's that? Okay. Nothing behind us. Let us continue. Looks like we're in a shrine. Ooh, I can check stuff. Looks like there's a cave wall on the other side of the latest. I can see some stone statues out in the darkness. I must be underground. Now? How did I get out? How do I get out of here? That's a good question. We're in an underground temple shrine. There's light at the end of the corridor. Maybe there's a way out. Maybe. It's a lot of moaning. <clears throat> yeah, let's get away from the moaning ghosts. Come on, let's go. They're chasing me. I have to get out. Hold. Sweet, I can run. That's awesome. Oh, man. some very dramatic visions that she's having. Alright, let's turn back around. And let's get out. So many cutscenes. Not what? Duh. That looks dangerous. I don't think she's getting out of here.
Who are you? Okay, door is open now. Thank, thank the spirits. And we've got a box in the middle of the room. Box in the middle of the flooded room. That seems unsettling, to say the least. Let me guess. I'm gonna open it, and there's ghosts inside. have to open it. Just run over and close the box. Just just close it. What's the ghost gonna do? Ah, what is up with all the hair? Ah, these ghosts have like a hair fetish. You. Slithering around me like snakes. Now that's just wrong. Yeah, you did. And we're outside. Are we a new character now? Miyu and Saki has disappeared. Okay. No one could hear her cries for help as she was sealed into the shrine on the top of the mountain. The mountain is where the events of the story take place. Follow the fates of three people. Okay. <clears throat> Yuri, Ren, and Miu. So are we gonna play as Miu again? It's a terrifying tale of the supernatural. First drop of Vanishing Trace. Playing as Yuri now. Alright, let's do this. Shadow reading. Among the residents of the village at the foot of Mount Hikami, a certain unique ability has been passed through the ages. This ability, known as shadow reading, enables the user to view the shadow or trace of someone lost in unexplicably, unexplicable circumstances. This is not unlike the psychometry practiced elsewhere. Yuri accompanies Hisoka, a woman who possesses the shadow reading ability to abandon in at the mountain. Ooh. Sensing Yuri could in time become talented as shadow reading, Hisoka takes her along on an assignment. Oh yeah. We're gonna contact Miyu. I thought that I'd be scared of death. But I can't even cry. No, it'd be the hair covering your face. You have ghost friends. In the end, I am alone. She gonna jump. I will end it all. Alone. Yuri? Huh? What we're looking for should be in here. This is an excellent chance for you to take the lead. I don't want to. Here. You do it. This. No. Ah. God. This is a camera obscura. It will let you see the unseen. I don't want to see the including unseen. Including the clues that will help you find what we're here for. 
This is your opportunity, your first case. <laughs> she just knows something bad's gonna happen, so she gives it to her assistant. I'm sure you'll do well. What a great boss. Let's start with a little practice. It works exactly like a normal camera. Give it a try. Just hold up the camera. Smile for the camera. Or not. Oh, okay. There we the go. The camera obscura photographs the netherworld, a whole other world separate from our own. There we go. Alright, so I'm gonna be graded on my photographs. That's great. That world that we see through the lens is completely off. Make sure not to draw too much interest in the things you see. Okay, how do I not draw interest? Oh, there we go. I gotta take a picture of your boobs. Nice. Alright, find the third. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. I can take the ball at the same time. Go. Now it's moving with me. Things around here seem to have changed. Take this. That is not a normal camera. I don't want that. That's so weird. It's a token. It will help lead you to what we're looking for. It's a photo of a dead body. Now don't panic, but be sure to stay on your guard. <sighs> Man, you're such a jerk. Head inside. Alright. Alright. Let's go. Let's go explore this creepy, dark, abandoned thing for ghosts. This is a postmortem photograph. It's not just a normal photograph. It was taken to more than there's dead. something over there. It's why Ren sent us here. But it seems that this photo came from somewhere around here, and he wants us to see whether we can find it. Oh, you're following me, okay. <clears throat> And she controls like absolute garbage. Something in here. Is that a bunch of hands? I don't like that. Okay. Got hands in the water. Should have given him a high five. Who are you? He's <laughs> coming for you. Lead the way, Ahsoka. I don't want to go anywhere. I'm seeing dead people. Yuri, wait. I can sense something. No, really? Couldn't sense the guy behind you? It's called a trace. A shadow of the past. The token is showing you the way. Alright, let's go follow this trace. trace. Did they ever lead me? Did they ever lead me in the wrong direction? Okay, you're walking so slow. Let's run. Ooh, what's this?
Mount Hikami's downfall. Excuse me. An old dusty book that is left in the hallway. Maybe somebody dropped it. Mount Hikami has long been considered holy ground. For centuries, people have been drawn to many sacred shrines and places of worship, as well as the natural features such as Twilight Peak and the Pool of Purification, which have themselves been treated with reverence. The mountain was also popular with tourists and mountain climbers for the beauty of its abundant clear waters and ancient mysterious forests. Worshippers and hikers alike used to find rest at the manor, a hot spring resort near the foot of the mountain. <clears throat> now the end lies desolate, devoid of visitors. The mountain never recovered from a devastating landslide it suffered many years ago. The shrine road to the summit was cut off and the flow of water throughout the mountain was altered, forever changing the landscape. New roads that were under construction had to be abandoned, and the manor was buried under a slew of rock, resulting in numerous fatalities. Among those were the family of the proprietors, effectively putting an end to the business. Mount Hakami's days as a tourist destination were no more. Instead, the mountain gained notoriety as a suicide spot. That's great. Perhaps because it was traditionally a destination to which the dying would venture. The mountain now a place of those wishing to end their own lives. By extension, it has also become a place of thrill seekers interested in the occult. Oh, that's great. Ooh, what was back there? Oh, that was creepy. Why? Why were you bent like that, you weirdo? Oh, I was too slow. In this place where the traces of the past are very strong, you may be able, able to view echoes of the past. F photographing them will earn you photo points, which you can use to upgrade the camera. Oh, that's cool. It's cool to know. I wish I would have known that before I missed taking the shot. Yeah, what's, what's in here? <clears throat> Let's figure out where the echo came from. Here's the bedroom. Anything? Oh, that's weird. I don't like that. Let's take a picture of it. Yeah, no points for that thing. That's just weird. Okay, and there's nothing in here. Wait. There's a step up here in the part of the floorboard I think that was dis was a display alcove. Alcove. There we go. But it displayed that creepy statue. Why would you close the door behind you? Just so something can jump at me? Alright, let's go. Yes, let's go through the door. Maybe it's in this room. Maybe it's in the only room that's there. It appears we need a key. Try using the camera obscura. What? When you look around through a lens of camera obscura, you may notice it reacting to objects which are not normally visible. Lock on and photograph them to expose places or items that have a connection with. Find the location from the photograph, and you may discover some clues there as well. Okay. Take a picture. Of course. Of course it's in that room that I was just in. Yeah, find the place shown in the photograph. It's somewhere in this building. Okay. Here, you go on ahead of me and look for the key to the door. I'll wait for you. You jerk, I don't want to. I want you to come with me. This is scary. That's a guy hanging from the ceiling. That's fantastic. I wonder if I can catch a picture of him on the way out. She opens the door so creepily. 
There we go. Okay, something's gonna grab me. Nope, didn't. Nice. Yep. Okay, so it leads me automatically there. Okay, cool. That's good to know, good to know. And you're the hanging guy. Man looking at a key. And he's gone. And this doll is now looking at me. Did not like that one bit. Let's go meet up with Hasoka. She, f she looks like she's floating. Those she has heels on. Okay, <laughs> they just match the background. Open the door. Yes. Somewhere in this room. Take a look around. Okay, let's take a look around. Is it in the drawers? Nope. Oh, there's something there though. Try searching with the camera obscura. It's a large hole at the bottom of the wall. I can see soil from the through. The naked eye. Yes, I know. Let me check around though first, okay? There's revealing black soil behind it. Okay. Ah, oh, you're a weirdo. Got your portrait. Hold on. There's something there. Okay, come on. The camera obscura will react to items that are normally hidden from the eyes of the living. You can bring those items back to this world by photographing the place they were taken from the correct angle and position. Okay. Figure it out. Oh, okay. So I gotta change the camera around. Okay, cool. That's good to know. Hey, another book! It's a photo album. This is what we came here for. Huh. We shouldn't stay here any longer than we need to. Yeah, obviously right. there's dead people roaming around. Let's head back before it gets dark. Okay. Soka's so weird. She just leaves me in here. She went... Oh my god. She... She climbed through that really fast. And there's a guy right there. I don't like that. Let's open Yuri, it. Take us. Searching for objects like we did just now might be easy, but searching for people is much more difficult. Yeah, I bet. We're hiding everywhere. To see the psychic imprint as a shadow. Never follow after the shadow of someone. Oh, okay. You might end up seeing something you wish you hadn't. Okay, then I will never follow a spirit. <laughs> Maybe. Wait for me. Don't go so fast. Even though you're tiptoeing. <clears throat> Something's cool. Hanging man, man. Uh oh. I bet it's that hanging guy. Oh, it's. The heck are you? Dies from his picture being taken. Still have to deal with the hands trying to drown me. Ghost will try to grab or attack you. 
Okay. There we go. One shot will force the ghost to let go. Ghost recoils when you took its photograph. Maybe taking more will exercise it. Okay, I gotta fight him by taking the picture. Okay, this is just weird. And he's dead. No, he's not. Holy crap. Spirit fragments break off the ghosts, take damage, and after a time, they are reabsorbed. Photograph the fragments before that happens. Really? Five or more targets are in view. Take a photograph. We'll knock back the ghost. The capture area will be red around the shutter. Okay. Okay, so I got it. There we go. He is dead. No, he's not. Fatal frame. Fatal time. When the capture area flashes red as a ghost is attacking you, you can take a fatal frame shot. You need to capture the ghost mid-attack. Apart from the knockback effect, fatal frame shots trigger fatal time. When you can take photos in close succession without using film. Fatal frame shots are very useful when spirits are too close for you to trigger the shutter chance. Okay. So I gotta wait. There we go. And is he dead? No, he's not. Gosh darn it. Attack range and attack power. Uh, the camera obscure only has an effect on ghosts with specific range. Ghosts that are too far away will not take any damage. The bigger the target, the more damage the camera will deal. Get close to ghosts for more powerful shots. Fatal time until he is mid attack. It's not dead yet. Where is he at? Is he behind me? Nope, not behind me. Is he through here? There you are. It was weird. Good. He is dead now. You are a dead ghost. I killed you twice. Man, that takes a long time to kill dumb ghosts. Are you sleeping? No, you should have at least given me a heads up. I am alone. Nah, you got those ghosts with you. Who are you guys? 
Probably the reason why this resort is closed. The occult stuff happened because of you. <laughs> They're gonna make him kill her. How terrible. She was that lady in the box with the hair. He just slashed her back once. <laughs> what? Ah, who are you? Um, Mr. Hojo? Hisoka came by a little while ago. Oh, Hisoka. What does she want? She found the photo book. She did? Yeah, here. Take a look. Take it, these aren't family photos. While learning about shadow reading from Hisoka, Yuri used the ability to retrieve an al album. <coughs> of post-mortem photos from a ruined inn in Mount Hikami. The album was requested by a certain Ren Hojo. As Ren awoke from a bad dream, he found himself tormented by uncertainty. Was it really just a dream, or a suppressed childhood memory? This question has plagued him for some time. Was he that boy who killed that girl? Nah, I got a rig B. That's not good. Alright, so that was the first episode in Fatal Frame, The Black Maiden. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, it's kind of quirky, kind of funny, but still pretty decent. Um, I definitely will be playing this a lot more on the channel, so... I hope you guys enjoyed this adventure. Stay tuned for the next one. Have a good day. Bye.